Hello, today I'm going to be doing a blackberry cider. I've never done a blackberry cider before, so I'm not sure how it's going to turn out. It's not a how to video, it's just showing you how I did it and to give you some tips or so you can learn from my mistakes probably. Um, I got 3 litres of apple juice and 1.5 kilograms of fresh blackberries picked yesterday. I left them um, overnight soaking in a bit of salty water to get all the insects out. What, uh, rinse them again and then I put them into my um, my saucepan. I'm crushing them all up. Might add a bit of water to it to see how much liquid. Just I'm going to see how much liquid I get out of it now. And then um, go from there. So I've added 400 millilitres of water and I got a bag oop, fingers, a bag of sugar. I'm going to add half of it now and see how it goes. I brought it to a boil. So, give me two seconds. I'm going to add some sugar into it now. About half a bag. Do. And then I'll just mix it all in. As I said, I've never done this before, so I'm not sure how it's going to turn out. Turn it over a bit. I'm not sure how it's going to turn out. But um worth a try, you know. Oh well, that seems to be dissolved now. Um I leave it I'm gonna leave it boiled for a couple of more minutes. It's been on for about ten minutes so far. So I'll give it another 10-15 minutes and then we'll go from there. I've added an extra two and a half litres of water. I done it gradually, tasting it after every so often, like just to make sure the blackberry taste is still there. Um, all I'm going to do now is put it through the sieve to get all the seeds and the bits out into a, a sterilised container and allow it to cool down. Once I've done that. Um, I will pour the apple juice into the demijohns. Uh, I've sterilised my demijohn and I'm in the middle of sterilising my equipment now. I'm going to be using uh, a tablespoon of yeast nutrient and a tablespoon of pectolase if I've got enough in there. Yeah, should I have enough. I'll use a tablespoon of that as well. Um, I'll leave this cool down now, and then you'll get. Uh, I'll get back to you then when everything's cool and ready to put in damage on. I put the pulp through a sieve and emptied it into the container. I didn't video it because it was a bit tricky. I needed two hands. Obviously, one hand is my thumb. It's for the camera, so I couldn't I couldn't film it, unfortunately. Um, but anyway, I added the yeast nutrient and the pectolase to each demijohn. One was pure blackberry juice, the other was three liters of apple juice, one liter of blackberry juice. Um, the blackberry juice come out at 140, and the blackberry cider come out at 150. So hopefully, if they both ferment right out, I should have some nice percentage blackberry tasting beverages. So thanks for watching. Happy home brewing, and I'll see you next time.